At the end of 2020, the UK government published its 10-point plan for a green recovery. It sets out how Britain will achieve net zero by 2050. EDF is playing a key role in the plan's delivery, and it matches our own plans to enable investment of £50 billion in Britain's low-carbon infrastructure. Let's look at the points EDF will play a big part in. Point 1. Advancing offshore wind. EDF Renewables is already building the Nartnagwir wind farm in Scotland as part of a 4 gigawatt renewables pipeline. Point 2. Driving low carbon hydrogen growth. At Sizewell C we hope to make it a major part of what we do and we're investigating wider hydrogen opportunities such as H2 production from renewables and H2 uses for transport. Point 3. Delivering new and advanced nuclear power. We're already building the first nuclear power station in a generation at Hinkley Point C, creating jobs and boosting the local economy. And Sizewell C is the only nuclear project ready to begin construction. Point 4. Accelerating the shift to zero emissions vehicles. Our customers' business is doing great work in this space. Podpoint is one of the UK's leading providers of electric vehicle charging infrastructure. And Pivot Power is developing a network of energy super hubs to enable rapid charging. Both are EDF companies. Point 7. Greener buildings. Imtech is one of the largest technical services providers in the UK and we're the UK's leaders in energy efficiency installations, installing more eco measures to insulate more homes and save our customers more money than anyone else. We recently launched our electric heat offer and we're helping our residential and business customers lower their carbon footprint. Point 9. Protecting our natural environment. By taking care of the land around our power stations and the commitments we make with our renewables and new nuclear projects, we're protecting the natural environment and biodiversity. Point 10. Green finance and innovation. EDF invests £2 million a day in R&D globally to support a low carbon future and EDF Group continues to blaze a trail on green financing and innovation. In the UK, Sizewell C and other projects are driving even more innovation. The remaining points include carbon capture, public transport and decarbonising the airline and maritime industries. Hydrogen is one potential fuel for public buses and trains and our work on hydrogen can contribute to this point. So, there you have it. More wind, nuclear, solar, storage, hydrogen, electric heating, energy efficiency and electric vehicles. We've been helping Britain to lower its carbon for decades. And it's great to know our future lies at the heart of Britain's net zero aspirations.